All right, y'all. So Chance the Rapper's brother, Taylor Bennett, comes out as bisexual in this interview. And I must say, uh, what? <laughs> Respectfully. And like the shit that Taylor is, like, I'm openly bi. Like, I don't know if you know that. So break that shit down. So you is gay. I'm openly bisexual. So you know in Chicago we call that gay. Do I gotta break that down? Cool. But like okay. my whole thing. We play right. Yeah. We but like to rack. go back to that shit. Like my whole thing is like niggas in the rack. Mm-hmm. Niggas on social media, right. everybody gonna call me whatever, but they not gonna know me for real. You know what I'm saying? That's why. So like, with that point being said, if you want to express yourself in whatever way, express yourself. The most gangsterous nigga that I know is Gucci Man. That nigga got an ice cream on his face. Mm-hmm. The other most gangsterous nigga I know wear hella purses. It's Young Thug, mm-hmm. and it's like. Again, the shit that bothered me ain't when a nigga like this what I am. It bothered me when a nigga want to be something he not because that's what everybody else want. And honestly, like like I said, growing up where I'm from, mm-hmm. it's gangster to stay who you is and it ain't easy. You know what I'm saying? Like to continue and still be able to move how you move. Hey, so look. This is a two-parter. All right, this is a two-part thing. First of all, I guess he tasting the rainbow. Uh, secondly, I mean, he right. Like it, it to to live in your truth is gangster. You know what I'm saying? It just uh, like to 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 come out like this on this platform in this way, and the dude dude said, "Hey, we from the shot. Like you just gay. Like that's a that's a that's a thing that bisexual men." Like are gonna have to deal with to the end of time, because no man is gonna be able to wrap his head around like you casually sometimes prefer guys like like that. It's just it's unfathomable. It's unfathomable because we're, men are logical. We we're like so we're so based in a lot. It doesn't make sense to to most men. Like you you'll get more understanding from women, but even women are gonna even women are gonna like be like yo like what like most women most women like you can you can say what you want to about like like oh we need to accept people and we need to accept the culture and different things of that nature it, it's it, especially the black community the way the way things are set up it's not going over well okay like all i've seen in the comments is gay like it's just like that it's just gay like it's crazy like gifts like they because they added gifts in the instagram gay. like i was like dang bro they like they the girl's fine bro but he he's standing 10 toes in his truth like you know what i'm saying and who he is like i can't do nothing but respect it like i ain't got no pro- i ain't got no issues or problems with him being that way you know what i'm saying like or like or people being like none of that like none of that bothers me like you know what i'm saying i'm not gonna lose sleep at night because i didn't know this and now that i know it what does it change for me? Absolutely nothing. What does it change for him? I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe he finally gets on in the industry. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that's how this this dark the dark forces work. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta jump on the the LGBT bandwagon, and then boom, next thing you know, you got deals and you got endorsements and all that. You know what I'm saying? Because he was ah, but yeah, I I just, I just really I just really feel like you know what I'm saying like hopefully his life. This does what it needs to do for him, you know what I'm saying? And it and it and it gives him what he what he wants from it. I hope. I hope. You know what I'm saying? I hope it 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 it, it ends in the place that he wants it to end and, and everything is like it goes the way he wants it to. Um it's kind of crazy to throw like ch- like throwing chance the rapper into this, you know what I'm saying? Like for clickbait purposes. Cause I mean, I, I'm not gonna lie, like if they just put Taylor Bennett, people gonna look at him and go, yo, is that chance the rapper? So I guess putting putting Chance the Rapper's brother kind of helps a lot with things. Um, man, shout out to Whoops Podcast. I mean, Whoops, yeah, Whoops Podcast and interviews. You know what I'm saying? Like he he got to like it's a cereal box. Um, uh, let me enlarge the image again. Like you can see, like back there in the backside right here, like it's a it's like a cereal box. You know what I'm saying? Like so really cool branding. You know what I'm saying? Um, I I just I just don't think our community is. I don't, I don't I don't think the black community is ever going to be I don't think the vast majority of the world in general if when I get it off black people right 
the vast majority of the world is like ready for people that are like, because it, it, we just got to the point where it's kind of like people go, okay, you're gay. Like, okay, you're a lesbian. Like people, people are okay with that. Bisexual is like throwing a wrench in all that. Because people want to put somebody like literally in a category. You're either here or there. You're not on both offense and defense. Like nobody, nobody, people don't think about that. Like people don't, people aren't ready for that. Um, but anyway, I'm going to get up out of here, man. Thank y'all so much for watching. You know what I'm saying? If you like this video, um, make sure you like, you comment, you subscribe, man. And let me know what y'all think of him coming out as bisexual. Uh, this doesn't bother me any, but I know a lot of people that's going to be shook up.